Hey, I just wanted to give you a quick run through about what's inside this white label package because Brad and I are really excited about this because it basically gives you the ability to rebrand this entirely as your own. So think about that. You can actually go out and sell this to clients, go out and sell this online, and everyone will think it's from you if you want them to, okay? You can completely rebrand this as if it's your software. We will support any technical um, things relating to the software. You can use our support for that and you'll be able to take care of any you know easy to solve issues as well. One of the great parts of this system as well is that you can add your own logo. You can also, as part of this, add users and manage users. So let me just quickly show you how that works. This is the white label setting. This is where you first need to go in order to start editing everything. Now when you first get in here, the first thing you're probably going to want to do is add a logo that is your own. So you could say, for example, search through um, your logos, and I'll just find a logo in my dashboard right here. Search through, uh, find a logo, for example. I could grab, uh, you know, a logo of mine. This is a new um, site of mine coming out soon. I'll see if I can add this in. We'll open this, we'll add it in, there it is. And then we can add a product name. So the, if, the, if this, for example, was my website, I would call it Click Factory. And I can completely change the product name. I can add a new support address. I can add a new domain. So you'll actually be able to connect this up to your domain. So when you sell this system, you'll actually have your own domain that this is selling from. And you'll also have your own domain where people log in from. So basically, no one will know that this is video drill or, or anything to do with video drill, which is really cool. Adding your privacy links, all that information is available through here as well. All the different details are available in this um, particular white label setting. Save, and then you'll see everything added. Now for me, I've obviously got a very big logo. It's got the background attached to it. I'd recommend getting the sizing correct. And then when you actually upload your logo, it'll look something a bit more normal like this right here. And I'll just upload this and add it. Cool, so you can change this as you want and all your users will be added in to the users column right here. You'll be able to add new users and you'll also get a link where you can register people or have people register automatically if you want them to for video drill as well. To set up a user, it's really easy. Type in all their details and set them as active. You can, yes, you are allowed to charge monthly for this. So there are a lot of softwares out on the web right now charging $97 per month for a software similar to this. You can do the same, you can charge that amount if you want, and if someone was to stop paying, then what will happen is you can set them as inactive. So if they email you, they say, hey, I'd like to cancel my subscription, no problem. You go into your user profiles, you go into your users like this, and you'd find the user and you just make them inactive. You'd tick the box, make them inactive, and then you're done. You can also search through your users and find all the details as well. But basically, everything is run from this dashboard. And when you change anything about this dashboard, including the color which you can change, the logo which you can change, then those changes will reflect on the user's side as well. So they'll see your logo, your colors, and everything that they should be seeing uh, to make them know that it's you behind this particular product and you are the person that sold it to them. So make sure you go down below, find out all the information. This is a quick demo of what's inside the admin panel of this system, and I look forward to hearing of your success. This is Sam Bagger. Talk to you again soon.